An octogenarian man was set ablaze and his wife seriously wounded on the head after a group of assailants raided his homestead in Embu County. Mary South Deputy County Commissioner Chaka Nyamawi attributed the incident to a land ownership saga and urged residents to embrace dialogue in resolving disputes instead of resorting to violence. When dusk set on Thursday evening, unknown assailants raided the homestead of 80-year-old Faustino Njerun Joka in Minura village in Berra South, Embu County. They set the old man ablaze and seriously wounded his wife on the head. <laughs> Alafu wakasi waka anja kupiga ndulu hasa wakipiga ndulu alafu wanafungia ile wasasi nyumba kwa nyumba alafu sasa wa msee alitoka kwa ndirisa sasa alianja kupigwa na na mawe na ile mapanga na nini akakibishana na yeye akaanguka tena alianguka alipigwa na mapanga alafu ile bibi yake akaenda kutoka na yeye akapigwa panga lakini alipata nafasi ya kuebuka e, na huyu mwingine huyu msee Another woman was lucky to escape with minor injuries. Confirming the incident, Mbera South Deputy County Commissioner Chaka Nyamawi said the assailants also touched three houses and two motor vehicles in the homestead. I was able to get this case in the case of 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 then ndo wakarudi kwa hii boma waliporudi kwa hii boma wa, watu around kwa hii kijiji sijui walikuwa na react kwa sebele yale mefanyika ukule ndo wakakuja kwa wafamia katika lia kwa wafamia uh, wakawafungia kwa nyumba wengine na huyu muzea kajaribu kutoroka lakini kutoroka kwake na huu matu likuwa mkubwa ndio wamekata wakiwa wanachoma nyumba hapa wengine wanakatakata miraa hapo nyuma ya nyumba kuna miraa imekatwa katwa mingi sana so wakaharibu kukata kukatakata hiyo miraa huku nyumba wanachoma mzee akajaribu kutoroka ndio wakampata kabla hajafika mbali wakamchoma hapo nyumba hapo nyuma Mbera South Sub County Police Commander Gregory Motiso said no arrests have so far been made, adding that police were following crucial leads regarding a land ownership tassel the deceased was embroidered in with a view to bringing the culprits to book.